cells of ectoderm differentiate to become norectoderm, capable of generating nervous tissue, and form a flat neural plate. These then begin to invaginate to form neural folds, and the neural folds then fuse over the dorsal surface of the embryo to form the neural tube. This neural tube is hollow, as is the nervous system. The brain possesses spaces known as ventricles, and the spinal cord possesses spaces known as the central canal. And so a hollow neural tube is established. These images are of the development of the frog nervous system. Here you can see the neural plate, the neural folds, and the neural tube. The neural tube which forms the nervous system is hollow, as can be seen in this image of the brain of an embryonic chick, the brain of an embryonic pig, and the spinal cord of an embryonic pig. This is a hollow nerve cord.